And we have some breaking news coming in. Just a day ahead of the verdict on the disqualification row in Maharashtra, the Uddhav faction of the Shiv Sena has filed an affidavit in the Supreme Court and has questioned how the Assembly Speaker, Rahul Navrekar, met Chief Minister Eknath Shinde on the 7th of January, just three days before the deadline for the verdict. Now, the Uddhav camp has raised questions about how a judge or an acting tribunal of a case can conduct a meeting with any of the party members before giving a verdict. This is a big development when it comes to Sena versus Sena, especially when it comes to the Supreme Court verdict, which is slated to be released tomorrow itself. What is now being alleged is that a meeting that's taken place between the Chief Minister Eknath Shinde and the Maharashtra Speaker Rahul Navrekar has taken place, and this violates essentially a code of conduct, especially when a verdict is awaited in the top court. ये तो इलीगल गवर्नमेंट है जो सुप्रीम कोर्ट ने भी कहा है तो इलीगल गवर्नमेंट के हाथों में दो साल तक महाराष्ट्र का भवितव्य रखना ये बहुत ही खतरनाक बात है और कल क्या होगा या कल क्या हो सकता है तो ये दो बार जो मिले हैं ये मिली भगत भी हो सकती है प्रजातंत्र की हत्या करने की साजिश शायद हो हो गई हो जिस ढंग से उन्होंने एक समय की बर्बादी और शायद कल और एक ऐसा कुछ कर सकते कि और समय निकले तब तक ये चुनाव हो जाएगा हमें कोई आपत्ति नहीं हम हम तो जनता के सामने हैं जनता के बीच में हैं और जनता तो जो न्याय देगी वो तो देख रही है लेकिन क्या हम खुले हम खुले हम हमारे नजर के सामने प्रजातंत्र की हत्या होने जा रही है उसको स्वीकार कर सकते हैं क्या the big development as far as the uh, Uddhav Sena versus Shinde Sena uh, disqualification war is concerned, it's only escalating now. Uh, a day before the deadline is to end, that is tomorrow, uh, 4 p.m. is when uh, Rahul Narvekar, the speaker, is to pronounce the judgment on the disqualification petition against uh, Shinde and 38 MLAs. And now, uh, just a few uh, hours back, uh, Uddhav Sena has filed a very important affidavit in the Supreme Court questioning how... Uh, uh, Speaker Rahul Navekar, who uh, is in fact a, 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 a judge uh, heading a tribunal. Remember, uh, even the Supreme Court has said that while the Speaker is uh, dealing with the disqualification petitions, he acts like a tribunal. So therefore, Rahul Navekar is a judge. And how could uh, Rahul Navekar meet Tegna Shinde at his residence at Varsha uh, on last Sunday, uh, three days before the deadline of pronouncing the judgment is concerned? And it will influence the outcome. Uh, it says that it will influence the uh, uh, influence the uh, um, this, that the verdict might get influenced due to this meeting. Uh, it also says that uh, the affidavit has been accessed by uh, the Times Network. It says, how can a judge or an acting tribunal of a case can conduct a meeting with one of the party before giving a verdict?